Castle Crashers is a side-scrolling beat-em-up in sort of the same tradition as Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Except this takes a fantasy twist on things, so it's sort of Dungeons and Dragons meets Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. You really got simple combos, just a couple of button presses to just keep doing kind of the same moves over and over again. You've also got magic that you can learn. It's addictive and fun, and it has sort of that same element of really classic, great side-scrolling beat-em-ups where, you know, even though it only takes a few hours to beat, you want to keep playing again and again and again. Now there are a couple of cool things about Castle Crashers that we haven't really seen very much of in games like this. The biggest one is that this does have some RPG elements. So you're going to be able to upgrade your character when you get experience points, you're going to be able to improve stats. But what really keeps this interesting is just that each stage is really inventive and unique and different and funny. So that even though the combat doesn't really change that much from area to area, you're seeing so many new and unique things that it really kind of keeps your attention drawn to it. On top of that, there is four player multiplayer. This is online or offline, so you can have three people on one console playing online against somebody else, which does make it a lot of fun because you can beat the game with one person, but just not nearly as enjoyable as getting four people together and storming through this. One of the big draws for playing Castle Crashers multiple times is the fact that you're going to keep unlocking new characters every time you beat it. And these characters not only will look very different, but they're also going to have their own unique spells as well. There's also a ton of secrets hidden throughout the world and lots of weapons. Really, there's just a lot of reason to keep playing the game. It is going to be more friendly to people who are just casual gamers. Anyone can get in and just start playing the game. You know, and it's just fun to keep leveling up. And certainly it's one of those kind of games where it's about the community. So it's playing with other people is what's really going to make uh, Castle Crashers come alive for you. If you like games like the old arcade Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles or that old Simpsons arcade game or even uh, Streets of Rage, this is the kind of game for you and it does have a little bit of extra geekiness with uh, the leveling up system so uh, it's definitely going to have some depth to it as well. Certainly pick up Castle Crashers, it's worth every penny.